guess who it is? Your least favorite YouTuber. It's okay. <laughs> Today we're doing something off from all things I do. That's right. We're organizing. Because everyone loves seeing organization. Mike, I don't know how to use headphones. So basically I'm going to give you the rundown and what we're going to organize. Okay. I have a remote here. It does not go here. It actually goes between my two pillows in my bed or on the floor next to my bed. And I have stuffed animals that we need to straighten up back here. I have a book on my desk. I have pens, more stuffed animals. I have Greg. I have lotion. I have a dog. I have some pictures. I have more things. And up here is just fine. Up All the way up here. And then we have to organize this, and then we have to organize these, and then we have to organize that, and basically that's it. <sighs> that was an awful. My mirror's gonna stay where it is. But first, because it's just easier for me to organize this way, it turned on. We're gonna take out everything in my desk. Everything. It might be a little bit harder to do, but it just makes when I put things back together easier for me, okay? So you're not going to complain about it. With help from this box, glance at it, do whatever you want with it. This box right here is going to help us organize our life. That's right. Okay, so this box here. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that. Okay, so first off, we're gonna destroy my main desk part. I'm not gonna take out my mic because I like it how it is. It took me forever to get it how it was. So we're gonna leave that. But we're gonna take off our raccoon, my favorite book, and things like that. So starting off with, we're not going to mess with anything on the wall that's staple either because we don't want to make more holes in the wall. Starting off with the top part of my desk that has a shelf that has Greg and all my stuffed animals and what's my microphone's hooked to, we're going to completely strip that first because it's one of the main attractions. We are going to take out my headphones because I do want to put them somewhere else. I might keep them there, but I don't know. These pens never work. They never do work for me, but I still have them for some other reason. Then these guys. Next up, we're going to do the stuffed animals and all of that on the second part of my desk. But first, we take off all the big stuff, like another notebook, my lamp, I've had for years now. I'm going to keep all of my Lucky charm stuff, and pencils and things. And then one of my favorite things, which we're going to clear out, my giant thing that has my name on that my grandma made. First off, top shelf has nothing. Second shelf has nothing. Ow, I got my finger. Third shelf has nothing. Fourth shelf, oh. Or shelf has some fabric. But other than that, it's all clear because I, when I get something like new that I love to death, I don't want to use it. But I know I'm gonna have to use it eventually. You have my camera, which is just sitting behind it. I use this camera a lot. I take photos. Right now, it's dead. I think. But I love it a lot. I need to find the charger because I haven't been able to use it in a while. We have like a whole bunch of Beanie Boos, like an owl, a phone owl, a raccoon. I've been collecting Beanie Boos for my whole life. It's a lifestyle. A monkey. And a chicken. We're not going to put that back on my desk. Don't ask why. I just don't want chickens on my desk. 
all the other stuffed animals. Ooh. Right here is where I'm going to put all my favorite charms in. Take down all this. And then what we really need for now is my drawer. Because that's probably one of the things I will I always have problems with. And while we do this, I'm going to explain to you a lot of everything. This is probably going to be a part for each shelf or whatever. But first, we're going to do the do this. The all taking down one is going to be an episode with some parts of it. Oh, it doesn't even look like my desk anymore. My laptop. I think I am going to take off this because I'm, it's kind of getting in my way right now. I want a clear vision of my microphone. So we're going to put this carefully on my chair. Okay, all the way down here. So we're going to move you a fat stack of papers and a drawing tablet, cords staples and a box stapler and then amongst many puzzles which is also not going to stay in here this box is also going to go with not with all those pencils or whatever it's going to go in my box where I keep all of my art things that I'm going to customize because I was going to customize this. But I haven't got to yet. I think there's still a pamphlet in it for my headphones. I'm going to put this with all my other pamphlets because I have a giant thing of... Here, let me show you. My room's clean. But because of that giant mess and there is still a clothes pile, I'm not going to show you my room. Another video, we're going to have to organize this. But, we're going to just kind of focus on this shelf. Which if we move around. Giant fat stack of receipt stuff. We're going to put everything I just took off back. And that's going to be a whole entire different video in a day. This is what my desk looks like. Plain. I do this, like, every couple months because my desk gets very dirty. Like, not the surface of it. The surface of it just gets, like, a little bit of dust. But the... Everything else, like, all the shelves and all that just gets super dirty. There's a whole lot of dust because it's been longer than a couple months because we went to Indiana for, like, a whole entire month. And that's the pile. Ugh. So, the best for last is going to be the drawer. But since this is already eight minutes long, I'm going to end the video here. With me finished stripping everything except the wall. So, I guess I'll see you guys later.